greetings of the day my dear friends if you are a researcher then this information will be helpful to you actually the point is about two references in a research paper in general practice i have observed that most of the researcher what they do actually they just copy paste uh, the references in their own research paper uh, they don't read uh, the complete paper and they don't know about uh, the uh, paper uh, which they have cited in their text but they use a uh, reference in bibliography so my request and suggestion is that those who are doing this practice they have to check it so the suggestion is basically uh, you will observe it yourself uh, being an editor when we observe that reference style are changing uh, after three or four references it means uh, it is uh, very clear that the person who is submitting the research paper is not uh, taking care of the references properly because uh, in uh, some cases uh, that were using the APA style uh, in the next one that is using Harvard, APA, APS, IEEE, like that, uh, right? There are number of uh, reference styles. So I'm not talking about to that. I'm talking just only that uh, when you are writing the research paper, then that time you just quote only those references which uh, paper you have read, right? Don't put any uh, copy paste references in your research article. Actually, what happens in the early stage of the research scholar, when one read the research paper, he or she observe the references at the end. So they usually, what they basically do, they just uh, copy the references from the bibliography and paste accordingly in their research paper then the sequence actually breaks automatically in the first case for an example you read x paper and uh, the reference style was different and then after you read uh, y paper and just copied the reference from there and the style will be obviously will different and uh, editor basically in the first instant can check it easily so this is one of the important point when you are writing or submitting papers anywhere just uh, check the reference style uniformly right that should be uniform so what have you to do uh, you just uh, uh, be careful that uh, quote only those research paper which you have read number one. Second point is uh, metadata is important uh, that matters so check the details uh, of the research paper very carefully for an example name of the author uh, their affiliations affiliations uh, of the uh, researcher and uh, then after doi number it is also important but it comes at the end uh, in a reference so first of all uh, check the name of the authors uh, and then after the title of the research paper and name of the journal name of the journal uh, right then after what was the volume issue number issue uh, number and then after uh, the uh, page number years or whatever the sequence is given right so you have to check it very carefully and keep uniform reference style in your research paper before submission you have to check it and the third one uh, doi number so note down the doi number very carefully sometimes a dot uh, actually break the link so keep it very carefully so these were some point uh, which i think uh, may be helpful for your research paper so don't use copy paste in the uh, your research paper just read the research paper if uh, that uh, concept is useful in your uh, text uh, then uh, take the idea and uh, give the citation thanks for watching this uh, video and uh, i'm hundred for any question you can comment if uh, information is helpful you can like and share but if you are using the software then there is no problem.
right mainly and not and uh, also there is uh, then there is no problem so problem is only when you are using it manually